How little can you exercise and still get benefits? Most people realize that exercise provides important health benefits, but people still don't exercise regularly. This is probably because most people don't like to exercise, and a common excuse is that they don't have time. This research should be of big interest to you, especially if you are one of those people. I have written about high intensity short interval training before, so you may have heard about that. But this study took this concept even further. Two groups of sedentary men on different exercise protocols were compared with a non-exercising group. One group did three all-out 20-second sprints on a stationary bike, with two minutes of recovery in between, three days a week, every other day. The other group did 45 minutes of continuous cycling at regular exercise intensity. Both groups exercised for 12 weeks. Peak oxygen uptake increased by 19% in both exercise groups. Insulin sensitivity index improved similarly in both groups. Muscle mitochondrial content also increased similarly in both groups. The mitochondria is the energy producing entity of the cell. One minute of real exercise time, three times a week, is apparently all it takes. As long as the exercise is as intense as you can handle. 3 minutes per week produce the same results as 135 minutes per week. So much for not having time to exercise.